y'all, Sarah Lou Who here, and oh, sorry ma'am, uh, we are back again with Kingdom Hearts 3. Bumped her. Um, let's see. I'm finally back after my foot surgery, and uh, yeah, it was out a bit longer than I was expecting with that, um, but they had to do a few extra things that I wasn't expecting, like break my fucking toe. So that was fun. I mean, it wasn't fun, but... <laughs> At least I got a lot of sleep and everything. Anywho, Kingdom Hearts 3. Uh, let's see, what happened last time? Last time we made our way through the woods with Rapunzel and just kind of got her where she needed to go. Of course, ran into Marluxia and his things and all that, but really not too much new has happened. It's just been that kind of stuff, right? All that, just making our way through the woods, just trying to get her where she needs to go. We had to cut the episode a little bit short before because I kind of ran out of time and I was expecting to have more time and all that. Hi, howdy. At least I didn't bump you, good sir. And Donald was freaking tearing through there. <laughs> Anyhow, but we have some stuff to do with the Moogle shop. Let's see. All right, so we can sit this materials, we can collect a blah, 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 get some stuff. I uh, got a pulsing shard and... Did I complete a phone mission? Wish I could dish work and see the festival. Maybe what's a picture of the festival? Really? Um. So ah! Hidden Mickey. Eh. Uh, let me see. No. If I zoom in. Ah, well, it doesn't count. Okay, does this count for. Oh. Let's see. Does this count? No, it does not. Oh, well. I was hoping that would be Concert Festival. I think they're having a they festival. are, Goofy. They are. You okay, man? You were just really slouching there for a minute. Uh, well, we'll have to go further in, I guess, to get the festival picture. But you guys were telling me I need to hit up the Keyblade Forge, right? So, let's see what we can make a bit more fancy. Oh, I have a lot of these things. Okay. Um, let's try to power up the Shooting Star, because I like that. It was a very awesome thing. Um, Kingdom Key. Let's see. I, I'd rather do the chair and deputy and the shooting star, probably. Hmm. Maybe just one more <laughs> on this and then. Alright. Do one more on that. Actually, let's just make it even. There, that's all nice and fair. Now they're all three, except for you guys. But you're our starter key, so I'm not going to bother. <laughs> Alright, synthesize items. Is there anything new? Oh, what are those? Ah, oh, those are just the crystals that we got before. Oh, is there anything new to buy? Do I need to upgrade Dawn to Goofy? Let's see. Uh, Warhammer and... No, I already got these for them, didn't I? Donald Goofy, remind me what I gave you. <laughs> Donald has- yeah, they have these. I already gave them these items. Though- oh, wait! But I haven't upgraded your freaking armor if you have been mean to do that. But first, let's see what I want. <laughs> Alright, fire bangle is small defense for distance to fire. Okay, small boost in defense, small boost in defense and dark resistance, and small boost in defense and water resistance. Uh, I'll take the shadow anklets. And any rings that are new? Or amulets. Uh, slight boost in strength magic and maximum AP. And small boost in strength, moderate boost in magic. And a slight boost in maximum AP, but it would bring my AP down regardless. Which I don't very much want to do at the moment. Alright. Uh, Donald set. So, Goofy, let's just outfit you with some stuff. We will give you a defense belt and an elven bandana. Or maybe a fire bangle. Fire bangle probably seems better. I don't think we've come across any real water things, have we? Hello, ma'am. I found some shellfish on the far shore. Tastiest meal I ever made. Well, good for you. What kind of shellfish? Delicious, delicious. Oh my goodness. Well, I wish I could help you with that child. Sorry, sir. Is that you? Well, I bet you there's a lucky oh, it's them. here. Oh, right, right, right. There are emblems all over the place. Uh, crap. Ah, oh, I see it. Let's this one, see. Goof. 
Okay, I got that, and then there was that one up there that I almost forgot about. Yeah. I bet we'll find some ingredients around here. Ingredients too? Goodness, weird as full of stuff today. Oh, child, what can I help you with? I want to go put flowers by the mosaic of the princess in the square. That's very good of you. Oh my god, can I buy them? Can I buy ingredients? Wait! Allow me! Or I could break it. I broke it! I stole from- I stole from these poor old ladies. Oh my god, zucchini, pumpkins, pumpkins. I would like to pay for these, this feels kind of wrong. Ah, hey! Shoo you! Be gone! You wretches, I see it! I see the chest! Terrible children. All right, what else got? More pumpkin. Seriously though, can we just pay? No. Why is it such a bad thing? <laughs> Still doesn't seem correct. <laughs> Like, you can braid it, but it, it's only going to take off a little bit. Her hair is way too long for that braid. It's for the last princess. See, that's the good child. Huh? Baby has a lot of hair. Huh? <laughs> Who cares about that, though? <laughs> There's festivities to be had. <laughs> Everyone, come dance with us! Alright. Oh, are we actually going to have to dance? Oh my god, we are going to have to dance. Celebrate the festival and strut your stuff. Approach the townsfolk and match their dances to quickly fill the gauge. Mirror their moves by pressing circle to spin or twirl or X to step and stomp. Okay, it's simple enough. When you've got yourself a partner, press square in the rings of light to clap along. Oh dear. Try pressing triangle near the town's VJs to perform special flourishes. When prompted, press triangle to get everyone in the middle and dance with Rapunzel. Pay attention to the colored rings of light on the ground and rack up a chain. Oh my goodness, you have way too much faith in me, game. I have no rhythm or dancing ability or anything at all. Okay. We will do our best. Can I- oh, no, no photos. Oh damn, which was which? Oh, okay. I just have to- Woo! We did it, bye! Yeah! Oh. <laughs> we got it! Oh, nope. He was, he was a stomp. Sorry. Oh, and they even have it colored. So I should know. Alright, okay. Alright, no. It's back to you. We're getting there. Oh, well. We'll just skip that one. My friends! We're sounding goofy in all this. We shall be dancing. How am I doing? Whoa. What'd I do? Oh. Are we dancing? It counts. Oh. Alright, I see what you're doing here. We got this! Not too bad. Everyone get in it! Oh, uh. I'm sorry, Rapunzel. I'm trying. I've suddenly gone colorblind! Oh, triangle. Big finish. Not paying attention to anything. Yeah, you get in here. Wait, can we dance with Finn? No, I can't. Oh. You got it. This is so fun. Oh. Wrong one. Sorry. Okay, now you're right. Hi, you changed for me. Okay. Slowly regaining my ability to see colors. Keep dancing. Try that. Oh, wrong one. Give me your hand again. There we go. Uh -huh. 
Oh wait, what was the triangle for? What's that? Oh, those are the flourishes. Okay. I'm not even paying attention. I can be awesome. You there, madam. Let's see what we can get. Well, there's Goofy and Donald. Is there anything else I can do? I wanna- yeah, I'll be awesome with you. <laughs> I hope that their go-to is just to fist bump the air. <laughs> Alright, sorry, triangle. Again, having too much fun with it. <laughs> Rapunzel's go-to is to just shove her freaking hands behind her head. Keep dancing. You got it. Oh, big finish! Sorry. It's like I feel like there should be more people. Like we should have a complete circle. To the boats. <laughs> All right, magic boost. Have I? I probably have a couple boots in my backpack. I should probably whip those out at some point, huh? <laughs> oh, there's a chest over there. I mean, how romantic! <laughs> Dude, she could beat somebody with that braid. Like, that would be a lethal whipping. <laughs> it's thicker than a rope. Seriously, she could break a neck with it. I've been or her own if she freaking headbangs. <laughs> for 18 years. Dreaming about what it might feel like when those lights rise in the sky. What if it's not everything I dreamed it would be? It will be. And what if it is? What do I do then? Well, that's the good part, I guess. You get to go find the new dream. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I don't know his stuff. Is he an iguana or a chameleon? I think he's supposed to be a chameleon. Just chilling over there. Was he there in the movie? I feel like I kind of lost track of him at some points during the film. He's on fire! Nah, it's pretty though. something for you too I should have given it to you before but I was just scared and the thing is I'm not scared anymore you know what I mean I'm starting to We get to set off our own lanterns. No, no, we'd, we'd just be third wheel and it if we set up somehow. I mean, that's all we've been doing this journey, but you know, it's whatever. I'm sorry. Everything is fine. There's just something I have to take care of. Okay. I'll be right back. It's all right, Pascal. But is it? 
Of course it is. Because you gotta have faith in your friends. Wow. <laughs> I think you want to see this. Could you guys have possibly picked a worse oh, time? I thought it was Marlon showing really up. I appreciate the moment, Sora. <laughs> Still pretty awesome to look it's at. Time for these wet blankets to go. <laughs> hey, let's see what we got. Seriously, I thought he'd come up and like have some awesome speech or something to give, but it's it's cool. I don't miss him that much. Although I am freaking loving seeing the city like this. Oh, festival! See. Does it count? Count it, damn you! <laughs> oh dear. Hyper hammer, let's go with it. down and the carousel should bring him in too fast too fast <laughs> I got all super excited oh are they gone Oh, no, there's more of them. But it's the weaker one, so we're good. Still so awesome. Actually, it looks a lot better on an open terrain like this. No punch. And stuff, because I feel like every time that we've used that freaking hyper hammer, like, finisher thing that's been doing, it's mainly been into the sides of walls or on, like, cliffs or something, and so you don't really get the full appreciation of seeing the ground get torn the hell up. <laughs> oh, is there another one? Oh, they are. They're up there! Ouch. Cool. Did we? Have we done that before? <laughs> and before it's too late. I'll go with you. Eh. Let me get to you again. Take out something, man. And we'll go ahead and get the carousel in here. Drag him in. Good enough. And that did it! Oh yeah, I should probably upgrade abilities too. We just got a couple new ones there. Alright, so if you have the Rising Spiral ability installed, you can launch enemies into the air, press X repeatedly to start a combo, and then press O to launch the target. Sweet! So I can throw people now. That's gonna be fun. Whenever you're ready. <laughs> Gotta go see Rapunzel and help Finn. Flynn? Finn. Uh, <laughs> great, I forget his name. Flynn. Pretty sure it's Flynn. I'm sorry, I just know him as Eugene for some reason. <laughs> like, that stuck with me a lot Eugene. more than the other one. Yeah! Eugene! They even got the ropes on him. Like, you could see that from where you were. That doesn't look natural. Oh dear, he's run off with the crown and forgotten you. <laughs> You're a terrible no, liar! He wouldn't. Which is weird, because he used to be a great liar. Who are you? <laughs> Forget Flynn Rider. Flynn! You know where you belong, and it's not with him. 
now. Be a good girl and come along. And don't beat them to death with your hair. <laughs> you kidding me? Rapunzel! Mother? So convincing. Oh, my precious girl. Mother? Are you all right? Are you hurt? Mother, how did you... I was so worried about you, dear. So I followed you. And I saw them attack you and... Oh my. Let's go. Let's go before they come to. <sighs> uh. Get over uh. it. <laughs> See, this would be much more convincing. Wouldn't it? <laughs> huh? Hey, isn't that Rapunzel? Wait! Rapunzel! Oh. Now, now. Show some decorum. <laughs> Marluxia! The girl has found her dear mother. You should let them be. And why is that? Because Rapunzel is far too important. Atop her tower, she must remain out of sight and live out her days with Mother Gothel. And never see anyone else? But that's like locking her in some prison. That is exactly what it's like. Rapunzel's hair holds the powerful magic of healing. And yes, Mother Gothel wants it for herself, as do others. And if Mother Gothel's actions will protect Rapunzel, preserve her, then she is doing the organization a favor. What favor? Let's say she's keeping Rapunzel on the shelf for us. An extra pawn in case you fail to find the remaining Guardians of Light. Mm. And we have occasion to call on other Hearts of Light instead. A new seven hearts to fill out the ranks. But that's... New seven hearts? Not great. Yes. Seven who inherited the Princess's Light after their role was fulfilled. So you don't care about her? You guys just want Rapunzel for your own purposes. Well, you're done here. Hmm. But they want you first. I just knew you would go and make a scene. Very well. Then it's lights out for you. You always were such a sound sleeper. So cool. <laughs> but we're good, right? See, there's no freaking way all that hair would fit in that braid. <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a cartoon movie, but it still bothers me for some reason. It's not like we don't know where she was. Petals look like the sun. I was the baby. <laughs> Buried so deep in your subconscious that you've been 
<laughs> painting the symbol on your walls all these years. I am the lost princess. Oh, please speak up, Rapunzel. You know how I hate the mumbling. I am the lost princess, aren't I? So much Did for that I shelf know? plan. Mother, <laughs> or should I even call you that? Oh, Rapunzel. Do you even hear yourself? Why would you ask such a ridiculous question? <laughs> uh, it was you! It was all you! Everything I did was to protect you. Uh, Rapunzel. I've spent my entire life hiding from people who would use me for my power. Rapunzel! When I should have been hiding from you! Where will you go? He won't be there for you. What did you do to him? That criminal's to be hanged for his crimes. No. No, no, it's all right. Listen to me. All of this is as it should be. No, no! You were wrong about the world. And you were wrong about me. And I will never let you use my hair again! <laughs> Okay. So again, this is another case of this cutscene just kind of going on a bit too long for me, I think. It's like, oh, okay, now we get something different. Alright, I'm down. <laughs> now I'm the bad guy. And of course, that's where you end it. <laughs> Ah, uh, but seriously, it's like they're rehashing the movie too much. It's like, we've seen it. Anybody who's playing this has probably seen it. They're probably huge Disney fans. <laughs> no, but you don't need to drag it out this long. I don't know if they're just happy to put it in the game or... Yeah. Somebody, like, wake us up. <laughs> Is Sora okay? We don't know. We keep calling his name and shaking him, but he won't open his eyes. Throw him in the ocean, that seems to work. <laughs> Wake up! Hmm. Unresponsive sidekick. Wait a minute. I know how to fix this. Kick him in the side. Max, give him a wash. Hey, see, there we go. Oh, oh no. That works too, <laughs> I guess. Oh. Oh. It's your true love's kiss. <laughs> <laughs> well, that did the trick. Nice How? <laughs> huh? How did I end up? Oh no! Flynn, Rapunzel's being held prisoner. That's right. In her mother's tower. And we already know this where calls it is for a rescue. Are you with me? Do, do we actually get to ride the horse? Alright, this should save us some time. You're overloading this poor horse. <laughs> Willpower! <laughs> Let's go, Max. Wow. <laughs> That's uh, ridiculous. Whoa, 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 Max. But seriously, like, let's just see what they say first and then I'll launch into it when we fight. <laughs> we'll take it from here, Flynn. Go help Rapunzel. Thanks. Yeah. So, the thing that's kind of interesting that we're learning a bit more with Marluxia, like, we've been getting, you know, more and more hints that they organization really wants us to, you know, kind of put things, well, not really put things back in order, but continue on the path that we've been on this entire time. And stuff, which has been, you know, the path of searching for Roxas. And 
all that. And I figure that would be so that they thought that he would be, you know, an easier being to work with given his relation to the organization and all that. But the way that Marluxia seems to put it is they actually want us to continue on about getting the seven light wielders of the Keyblade, I suppose, together. Okay, there we go. Right there. I was like, why is the battle music still playing? But, um, yeah, it seems like they want the seven Keyblade wielders to actually get together for some reason. In which case, I think our plan to have seven fight thirteen might not go according to our plan. Because maybe there's some way that they can twist it. It's the green thing. Oh, that's my save. What? What am I killing? Did you see something I didn't, Goof? No, you didn't. <laughs> Alright. Leave save. Okay. Uh, big save. We go on Twilight Town. Oh, goodness. I just noticed. Freaking creepy toy store. <laughs> uh, let's. Eh. Hey. Then we got our way. We are just going back to this. Yes, yes, we are. Oh, special one. Yes. Woohoo! And we'll get you. And all of your little buddies, too. Oh, almost out of the truck, game. <laughs> yep, out of time. Well, at least we killed some things. Ouch. <laughs> Not that thing, though. <laughs> Which was really would heal. Oh no, and I forgot to freaking equip my ability like I was planning. Yeah, that works a lot better. <laughs> Okay, but what if I did this? It's over. Did I get it? Yeah, we got it. I got that. That was hitting Mickey for a minute, but it's not. All right, continuing on our way, of which I hope is the correct way home. I'm assuming so, because I mean we're just coming into contact with all of these guys, so eventually we must be going the right way. Then you do it, you. You do it all day long, and there's two of them there, so double the hits. All right. As long as we go the opposite way of the corona signs. Is it just me or are the heartless multiplying? That can't be good. Hurry! It, is it because of uh it's because of Mother Gothel is she doing something? To multiply them all? Dang the Donald already level 20? Or not 20, level 19, but close to 20. Almost there. Alright, let's see about that ability I was talking about earlier. Okay. So we can do fire based, water based, air combo. I could probably add a couple of these. I don't want those. Super jump, do need. And rising spiral. Flying splash, counter splash, and let's see if we can stick in the air combo. And fire boost. You're too much though. Don't know. Do you guys like auto cut, don't you? I'm sure they're fine. Always oh, retain it. Okay, yeah, second chance, all that. And damage light. Recover MP each time you take damage. Sure. Alright. 
Is there anything else of good use for us? Don't really care about any of that. Gummy phone. Got all my lucky emblems. Speaking of which, how are we doing? Huh, we almost got half of them. And, okay, sorry. We shouldn't be playing on our phone. We have important things to do, like saving people with equipment. <laughs> Not equipment, what am I looking at? Items. That's what I wanted. I want to use my strength boost on Sora. And I want to use a magic boost on Sora. And all the AP boost on Sora. And... Sounds about right. Let's see. Do I have anything else I could equip with Sora? Let's stick that war boost on there. Alright! Doing great! <laughs> yeah. Here we go. And we have the Drill Punch. But yeah, was I talking about anything? I feel like I was talking about something, but I don't know if I had anything else to say. With that are then... Yeah, the organization wants us all together for some reason. But what reason could that be? I don't remember going through here. I certainly don't remember fighting all you guys. Well, you do it, Gabe. Take him down! All right, and now we get to chase yeah. Gamping out. Clash of Kingdom game. Oh no, my sight's there it is. <laughs> All right, I'm trying to use the map up top. So I don't think we actually, do we actually have a proper map somewhere? And I'm just being a dingus and not using it. Forgot about that secret little candy. Ooh. Hey, it's been a while since we've seen you, baddies. <laughs> and of course the freaking chariot. What was that? Hi <laughs> the hammer. And this should speed things up a bit for us. Wish there was a way we could freaking ride him. Like for some kind of combo. Okay, like don't you- okay, there it was. It's like, you gotta come in with that heal at any point? Just waiting for it. Water effects got a little weird there for a minute. Alright, there we go, nice prop. Fine! Okay, first things first. I mean, I guess that works, but that's not what I wanted. Let's deal with you later, Goo. Just kill these guys real quick. Or these two. Three. Oh no, should I be watering them? They are plants. <laughs> And I got an armor slot. Nice. Wouldn't be able to stack so it's fierce. I thought I'd never see you again. Huh? Huh. Actually, he went through with that. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> so he stabbed you in the back, bro. Unless it went clean through, but I don't think it's quite long enough for that. Oh well, you'll be fine. <laughs> The tower. Yeah, yeah, give me a minute. I know, I know I'm going. Alright. Couple coins. Special coin protect sword from the... Oh, yeah. It's my phoenix down. Did I get any of those? I should probably grab one of those. Oh, no, but it was pointless. I remember talking about this because it's like... But then again, it would be good to have during, like, a proper battle. Okay, I don't think there's anything else. Um... Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'm just double checking, making sure everything's nice and 
Fantastic. Alright. I'm going! And quick save here. <laughs> Just so we don't have to check back through anything. Meanwhile, Flynn's bleeding out on the ground. I'm sure it's Wait, wasn't there oh well it doesn't matter. Thought there was a hidden Mickey somewhere around there. Did I get that one before? Stop fighting me! No! I won't stop! For every minute of the rest of my life, I will fight! I will never stop trying to get away from you! Strength! But if you let me save him, I will go with you. Uh, no! No, Rapunzel! Uh, uh. I'll never run. I'll never try to escape. Just let me heal him, and you and I will be together. Forever. Just like you want. Everything will be the way it was. I promise. Just like you want. Just let me heal him. In case you get any ideas about following us. You... Eugene! Oh, I'm so sorry. Everything is gonna be okay, though. No, Rapunzel. I promise. You have to trust me. No. I can't let you do this. And I can't let you die. But if you do this... But if you do this, then you will die. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Rapunzel... Wait... Sharpest mirror ever. Eugene. But still beautiful. <laughs> no. Oh, no. No. What have you done? Wither and decay, B! What have you Battle when you can just trip about the towers. <laughs> this is me. I get to fight Marlisha instead. I'm down. <laughs> Fall into darkness. We can't allow her near our pure light now. Her presence would only cast a pall over it. Oh, oh my. What are you making? Oh, a tree. A weird, snaky tree. I have to say, Marlisha, not your most creative, but it works. What happened up there? Oh my. She shoots freaking crows out of her face? Okay, yeah. <laughs> Got the hammer. And I'll bring us through. I mean, I get how the leaves look like her hair and stuff, but... I feel like they could have done a bit more. <laughs> I mean, it is an awesome design, don't get me wrong. And stuff, it's just like, I feel like, whoa. Neat. I don't know what I'm doing. I can't run up it! Why does this feel familiar? 
There we go. No! Out! I'm just a dink. What? On- oh, it's just stuff falling on me. Suck it! I'm coming to kill you! Okay, but wait. Yo! Jump Sora, God! <laughs> Yeah, nice strong hit. Okay, uh, Donald? Donald? <laughs> Rage form it is! And can I use magic? Risk charge! Sure! This counts, this counts, this counts! Okay, this is actually working out pretty fantastically for me. <laughs> I wonder how Sora, I mean, not Sora, I wonder how Marluxia feels about me embracing my darkness like this. Like, am I still very pure of light with all this rage building up inside me? Attaboy, Donald. What is that? What was that? Is that doing anything particular? Oh no. Okay, but... I'm sorry. Oh, that was her. I didn't know what was happening with that. <laughs> I thought they were like going to help us or something. Fine. That was close. Yeah. Poop, here we go again. Oh well, her health's almost gone. At least I know what to do now. Where's my out? Where's my out? Quite out, but yet, man. All right, come on, come on, come on. Back off. Hammer again. And she just has one more notch to go after this. Okay, you're almost dead. So, you won't have to worry about this weird bush form you've taken. And they're level up! And Goofy has some more accessory slots. I really need to treat Goofy better. Need give him some more stuff. Don't go. Stay with me, Eugene. <laughs> you were too late, Sora. Oh. Flower, gleam, and glow. Let your power shine. Make the clock reverse. Rapunzel. Bring back what once hey. was mine. Rapunzel. What? Uh, Rapunzel. You were my new dream. And you were mine. Who's cure? <laughs> or dye my hair blonde and call me Cloud. <laughs> I also have a Koopa coin. <laughs> I 
guess none of these things fix stab wounds. <laughs> Just the soul hurt. Heal what has been hurt. Change the fate's design. Save what has been lost. Bring back what once was mine. What once was mine. Did I ever tell you, I've got a thing for brunettes? Oh, Eugene! <laughs> you know, all this made me think of? was what kind of hell it would be if the power was in her eyelashes rather than her actual hair. Just never-ending eyelashes. <laughs> the absolute agony. Wow, Rapunzel, you're finally gonna get to see your real home. And your parents. Your real parents. I know. I mean, I can't believe it. I can finally be with my real family. I couldn't have done it without your help. You're welcome. <laughs> well, from where I'm standing, the kingdom couldn't ask for a better princess. And I couldn't have asked for better sidekicks. Thanks. Yes, thank you so much. Mm-hmm. Now, Flynn, you and Maximus play nice. Huh? All right. <laughs> You're gonna be great. Huh? huh? We haven't seen the guy controlling the monsters in a while, so that's one less worry. But there's He's still not a chance in her that anymore. he might be around here somewhere. Which case, we'll, we'll come back. If he comes back and tries to bother Rapunzel again, then Flynn will keep her safe. And we three won't be far behind. True. But nevertheless, I won't let her out of my sight. Oh, Eugene. Eugene? Oh, <laughs> that's my real name. Eugene Fitzherbert. That's right. I never told you guys. And now we know. <laughs> well, I think it's a great name. Me too. Nice to re-meet you, Eugene. Hey. See, no one made fun I of you. I thought I was the only one you were going to tell? Don't worry. I've saved plenty of Fitzherberty secrets just for you. Oh, goodness. Really? Hey, what are you two lovebirds talking about? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. I'd rather you didn't. No, it's not nice to keep secrets. This one is none of your business. <laughs> Maximus, get him. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you would got to be kidding me! <laughs> Kingdom of Corona. Past. <sighs> I really did like the combat and like designs of all these areas and everything. It's just a keyblade with emphasis on magic from changes to Mirage Staff. Can't wait to see how that one acts out. But, no, it's just, I really get tired of the retreading thing. Like, I thought we were past that. Especially with, you know, Hercules area and, like, the Toy Story area and all that being a bit more original with their own stories. Again, I didn't care too much for, like, the kind of 
you know, point A, point B quest system thing that was going on with the Toy Story area, but I feel like, you know, there was new stuff happening with the story as opposed to this, where it was the retread again. I don't know that. Like, I would have liked it a bit more if, again, they had, you know, gone with some more insight into the whole Mother Gothel Rapunzel situation, but they just kind of flit it past there, especially at the end. And everything. Yeah. I don't know. I enjoyed the areas. It was just... Again, the cutscenes just kind of killed the pace a bit for me. Alright, ever after Keyblade can be form changed into a magical weapon called the Mirage Staff. While form changed, press the square button to evade and leave an avatar. Oh my god, what? We can leave holograms of ourselves! Okay, worth it. <laughs> in your place, the next time you use a combo, these avatars will join you in their own magical attacks. And they act as backup? Okay. <laughs> hey, Mal Pete. What you guys doing? Another world where we got doodly squat. Hmm. You sure this box thing is even real? Yes. Are they actually yeah, going to get their hands on this? <laughs> it is etched. Don't answer that. I want to find out, but still. It's what? Etched? Come with me. Where to? Those bozos ain't gonna help us. Soros sure not looking for the box. Who said anything about following them? Our paths just happen to align. No. Whatever will Mal do with our mystery box if she gets her hands on it? Find out next time in Kingdom Hearts 3. We don't really have a subtitle, do we? Is there one? Where's my box? Eh, it's somewhere. Oh well. <laughs> Quest for the light. Let's go with that. <laughs> what? We're too late? Yes. Evan would know all about the replicas from his time as Vexen in the organization. He was re-completed like the rest of us, but he didn't regain consciousness. After Lee left, he must have woken and taken his leave. Alias here and Dylan went out and turned the whole town upside down to try and find him. But he's no longer on this world, but is no he? no Evan. That's not good. What about his research? Unfortunately, his work on the replicas was incomplete. Did they make there his eyebrow shorter? Documents around, but all of them from well before he made any significant progress. Do you have any idea where he might go? There's no place that he could go now that he's human. He has no means of leaving this world. I think you under uh, underestimate him. Corridors. Mm -hmm. Are beyond his faculties and mine now. I mean, Vexen would probably have a oh. backup plan. But not everyone's. What if Evan was taken? Or went willingly. Of course. The organization could also use the replicas. To fill out their ranks. Wait, is this going to be we a rescue? Master Yen Sid. And Sora. And the others, too. Hmm. Seriously, this is going to be weird if he is also turned good by <laughs> just regaining his heart. Like, when he was Vexen, he was probably one of the more evil of the fellas. He's that very cold-hearted and... <gasps> this looks familiar. Humanity is a precious gift, and yet you desire to return to the organization? Oh, yes. Yep. <laughs> of course. See? Totally evil. One eradication at Axel's hands was enough to learn where not to place my trust. He gave you a second lease on life. He ripped me away from the one thing I care about. I don't require humanity. Give me my research. I must see it to fruition, no matter the cost. The replicas. Yes. <laughs> Soon they will replace, not just replicate. 
given a heart, they can become just as real as any human. Good what excellent know. tidings. I would hate to think we invited you back into our ranks, only for you to fail to deliver our final vessel, Vexen. <laughs> uh, such a creep. Love him as well, though. I really do care for a lot of the organization members. They're just so terrible, though. <laughs> like, I really can't wait to see what we... Eh. You guys should check it out. Yeah, yeah, new boy, Jen. How to you to switch between zones? On your first visit, you will start your voyage at one of the zone's waypoints. Okay. Well... What do we have here? Is this the new area that we're looking at? <gasps> oh! Oh! Doors! Doors! Monsters, Inc. And that must be frozen over there because there's all snow. Okay, yeah, we ready for this. Oh, which one, though? Which one? Are those two other planets as well? Or is that something else? Uh, we'll, we'll have to wait and find that next time. <laughs> and I'll, uh, as much as I would love to go ahead and get a start on it. And everything. I really need to prop up my foot because I think it's swelling just a little bit. Anywho, um, yeah. So thoughts and opinions for this episode. I think I made it pretty clear about how I felt with the Rapunzel area, so I'm not going to linger too much on that. Um, back to the organization members though. So, yeah, cool that one ahead of time. And so Beck said, yeah, he's never really been the warm, cuddly type, has he? But then again, neither really was Sniffer or Angry Brows or any of those other guys. Or freaking what was his name? The one that... I can't remember the one that uh, was trying to, you know, control Beast. All that. They all seem pretty damn evil too, but, you know, humanity granted them some agency. And all that. But, good news! The replica experiment is going on a little bit better. And all they need is some hearts now, huh? Alright, so... <laughs> what is turned? Oh goodness. So, we thought that the organization did the kidnapping, so we're going to go set out on a rescue mission, in which case we will be now the ones who are doing the kidnapping. Our moral area is getting a little more gray, I think. <laughs> but, it's all good. As long as we triumph over evil, right? Although, you know, Marluxia's questions still remain about what is right and what is wrong in this situation and stuff. I did like how, you know, he was talking about you know, the Mother Gothel Rapunzel thing though back there and stuff, how he preferred to kind of keep them in a state of limbo where they would in fact be balanced because Mother Gothel would be the dark and Rapunzel would be the light and keeping them together, you know, looking out for one another would keep them in this state of like protected limbo. And all that which would keep her on the shelf, as he was saying, to take Sora's place if Sora somehow failed. So before, they were hoping to take Sora in as the 13th member for the new organization and everything back in Dream Drop Distance. But apparently they've given up on that and are rather hoping that he'll, you know, go ahead with the you know, Seven of Light path that they've set up. But it seems like they also have good reason to doubt him because he did kind of fall in Dream Drop, didn't he? So it's going to be interesting to see how this plays out. I have no doubt that he will in the end, you know, charm things good and light and all that. But it'll be interesting to see, you know, what paths lead us there first. So, yep, that'll be it for this episode. Uh, like and subscribe if you guys want to, and thank you for watching.